So about a year ago, I went online looking at these things called UVC sterilizer lights, and they're lights that can basically sterilize just about anything. They kill bacteria, they kill viruses. I'm sure you've seen them before. And what I wanted to know is, are the ones they're selling on eBay and Amazon, do they really work? Because I know it's a legit technology because it's been around for many years and they use them in hospitals to sterilize things. So I wanted to put them to the test and see if it actually worked. So that's exactly what I did. And I have that information for you right now. But first, I wanna tell you a little bit about UVC light. So this is the visible light spectrum. You remember your friend Roy G. Biv from high school? Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, violet? Okay. Maybe that's just me. Anyway, ultraviolet light is in the lower part of the spectrum, actually between 200 to 280 nanometers. UVC is an even smaller part of the spectrum. The light works by damaging and inactivating the DNA in bacteria and viruses. So I went online and I searched UV light in my stock video library, and this was the video they sent me. Not the video I was looking for. This is actually a black light, which is a type of ultraviolet light. It's just used mostly at parties and doesn't actually sterilize anything, especially this video. UV lights in general are used in a lot of industries though, like in dentistry. Okay, so back to my experiment now. I went online and I got a couple of these things. This is a UVC sterilizer light that plugs into your basic light socket. It's an LED light. So here's how I tested it. I grabbed a couple of Petri dishes. I inoculated bacteria on the first dish to use as a control. Then I did the same on the second dish. This time I exposed it to the UV light for a few minutes. I stuck them on my incubator for a few days to see what happened. And ready for this? This is what happened. Absolutely no difference. The plate on the left is the control and the plate on the right was the bacteria I exposed to the LED light. They both grew bacteria. I actually repeated this experiment a few times, exposing it for different lengths of time. I got the same results every time. So that means this is a complete waste of money. It cost me 79 bucks and that was 79 bucks down the drain. I will never get back again. I will never order this again and neither should you. So here's the next thing I ordered. I got this magic wand for around 30 bucks. It's made of really cheap plastic. The idea is to wave it over a surface and it will kill everything. After my previous experience, I was extremely skeptical. There's no way this thing would work. I repeated the same experiment again. So this time I used just one Petri dish because it was the only Petri dish I had left. This little cheap thing caused complete death and destruction to all the bacteria on the right side of the dish. And that was just after an exposure of just five seconds at a distance of two inches. So I was completely dumbfounded. I mean, I had no idea that was actually going to work out that way. So how do you know which of these things work and which don't? There's actually a pretty easy way to tell, but first you have to know how they work. Sterilizer lights work by putting electricity through a mercury vapor. So the lights that work usually have a glass tube with a glowing gas inside them. If your light has a tube like this, it's most likely gonna work. So that was a pretty amazing experiment. I couldn't believe it turned out the way it did. But I have to tell you, these lights are not completely safe. You can get a burn on your skin by exposing your skin to them. You can also get a burn on the cornea of your eye. Now, a lot of people think that it actually burns the retina of your eye, but that's not true. The wavelength is actually too short to get through your cornea to the back of your eye. So it's actually burning the cornea of your eye. It's like a sunburn. And that's not something you really want, is it? But hey, if you like this video, please like and share it. I would really appreciate it. And happy sterilizing.